In other matters, corruption is threatening to roll back gains secured after the adoption of the devolved system of governance. Devolution Cabinet Secretary Eugene Wamalo is calling for enhanced collaboration between government agencies and professional bodies such as the Institute of Certified Public Accountants of Kenya to tame the vice. Over 300 billion shillings of public cash in Kenya is said to be lost through corruption annually. This is despite the involvement of professionals such as accountants, auditors and engineers. Devolution Cabinet Secretary Eugene Omalo believes adherence to both professional code of conduct and constitution will help reduce cases of wastage of public resources. The COVID-19 crisis is not just a health crisis. It's a financial crisis. It's an economic crisis. And when we are talking finances, the profession of accountancy is very, very important. When we are talking about public uh, finance uh, uh, management, you play a very important role. And at uh, Safari Park, we engage about this to see how we can give more capacity to our counties to discharge their mandate in terms of uh, ensuring uh, proper public finance management. Accountants are being challenged to come up with solutions that will help revive the economy that has been ravaged by the current coronavirus pandemic. This disruption has pulled at our business outlook in ways that may never be reversed. But while this change is happening, I take this opportunity to challenge you, accountants, to continuously transform yourself to suit the new demands of the society and industry. The industry expects strategic professionals who do, who do not only think beyond operational tasks, but also get immersed in the strategic outlook of the organizations. They serve as accountants. They made the remarks in Mombasa during the 36th annual conference for the Institute of Certified Public Accountants of Kenya. Reporting for Channel 1 Business News from Mombasa County, I'm Michael Mondiga.